Hello everyone, Argon Matrix here, welcome you to episode 15 of Let's Play Secret of Mana. And uh, last time we finally got to this freaking Moogle village. Spent a long time going in circles straight around it. And now we have this riddle to solve. Uh, walk the seasons from spring to winter, spring again, and we can enter. Now, uh, no one actually outright gave the answer in the, co in the comments of the last video, which I appreciate very much so. Because I'm pretty sure... Well, I'm pretty sure no one did because it's just so easy to figure out in the first place. You gotta start in the one that's, uh, spring. Right? Is that how the riddle goes? Or does it start at winter? I kind of forget. Well, this should be spring, right? So, so I gotta go from spring, then over to summer. I'm just gonna kind of try to charge through all these guys. I don't need to be deal dealing with them right now. And this is autumn. Gotta love autumn. Autumn's probably my favorite season out of them all. Actually, I don't know. Spring is actually really good too. Oh, God, I hate being confused. It's so weird. Okay, there we go. It's like being... I don't know, something about confusion in games other than Mother 3 is just so strange to me. Alright, and then spring again and we can enter. Is that how it's gonna go? I heard a little thing. So, oh... That was from the right. <laughs> really, I thought it was from the left, or from up your bung. Okay. So, I assume that I did that right then. Yeah, ow, god damn it. Mm, I wish there was somewhere to heal, like, that didn't involve me wasting MP or items or anything, because <laughs> Sydney, nice way to clip through all the trees. That was pretty great. Well, let's see what's happened over here, then. Because it said that we can enter now, so... I don't know what's going to happen. Uh... Hello? Did nothing happen specifically here? Did it happen somewhere else to the right? Did I go to the wrong right? What do you guys say now that I've solved your riddle? Uh, nothing, apparently. Okay. Hmm. Well, I guess it's just in uh, another area, then. I mean, it shouldn't be too hard to find, right? We're not going to have another episode of absolute, just total back -ass words traveling around trying to find out what, where to go next, right? Dude, you're confused again. Stop it. Crap. Normally, I'm good at, like, reverse controls, but I don't know. Something about this is just, like, sometimes, I don't know. Sometimes it seems like up and down isn't inverted while left and right is here. But then at other times, it seems like they're just all inverted. It's really kind of weird. It's probably just me, like, tripping out. I don't know. Whatever, edge reached level 17, so that's pretty good, I guess. Come on. This is retarded. I know I did something I had to have, right? Okay. Just up here? Oh, is, is it? Is it up there? Well, crap. That was so stupid. I'm back! And win. What the? The village is in shambles. What on earth happened? Hey, something's here. Yeah, I heard that. What? Oh, of course. Of course it's a boss. Eh, the village doesn't look too bad to me, actually, dude. It's just kind of deserted. It's you guys. You're the boss. Are are they? What? 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 <laughs> I, the boss music's going, but there's really nothing hap- Can I not- Okay, I can't attack these guys still. Is it just up here more, then? Hmm. Oh, hello. What the f- God, this big bird's retarded cousin. Hey, you stay here. I should probably- I should probably have healed before going into this. Oh, yeah, cause, uh... Let's see, Sydney, can you cast some cure water on us here? Right quick. Uh, yeah, there we go. Just to be sure we don't die, cause we're kinda running low. At least two of us were running low on HP there, so... All right now, Edge, how about you try and cast some of your magic too and make this a little bit easier on us. Uh, let's see, Earth Slide, maybe? Spring Beak, <laughs> Spring Beak! Uh, oh God, that's crazy powerful. Well, I guess I just, I'll just keep up with that then. Uh, 
Yeah, I'll just go Earth Slide again. It should be more powerful, right? Can I not do it? Apparently not. What the hell? I don't know, for some reason, like, it wouldn't let me cast it or something. There we go. Okay. I guess he just wasn't on the screen enough or something. Dude, you didn't even cast it. Crap. God, that looks so painful. Look at how his eyes go. Oh, wait, what? Dude, he silenced all of us. Everyone's confused now. Shit. Okay. Oh, I can't do it. I can't cast any, like, magic when I'm confused, so I, so I just have to, like, wait this out then? Ugh. Try and hit this guy, maybe? Oh, God. Dude, he is kicking my ass. Well, he's not so bad yet, I guess. Balloon level four. <laughs> nice balloon. Reminds me of Bear in the big blue house. God, that keeps her immobilized for a long time, apparently. I mean, I guess it should. Mm, oh, well, there you go. Man, he looks even more like Fox now than he ever did. Booyah. <laughs> it looks like Sydney and Edge there, just like one conjoined blob of happy goodness celebrating. Way to go, champ. Got boomerangs orb, sweet. So we can upgrade our boomerang again from whatever it is now. What is this? And we got more <coughs> God, excuse me. Got more sad music again. That sucks. I was half expecting another boss like theme to start going out and be like, what are you kidding me? Oh hey, let's talk to this guy first before we just go crazy. Ugh. Gramp grandpa. Oh, sounds like is that you, little tyke? Grandpa, can't you see me? Empire's men and undid the wind seal. A bright flash around stunned me. The others, they're dead. This is awful. No, they must have escaped. I suppose so. Ooh ha ha. Grandpa. Ah, okay, okay. Tyke. We sprites are the part are the we sprites are a part of the mana. That beast couldn't have beat us. But humans are bra are breaking seals and releasing monsters. Which are consuming our source of life. Mana. I'll put a stop to it immediately. These two can help. I'd go with you if I could see better. At least take Sylph and the wind elemental with you. Oh, that's kind of you. You call me master? These young people are now your master. It is so. <laughs> he looks funny. Sylphid's powers, yay. Third type of magic, baby. Use analyzer to learn what magic works on crystal orbs. Use magic on the orb in this forest to open the way to Ma Matango. It's said a white dragon lives in a cave north of Matango. The dragon can help you. Go now, and worry not about me. Grandpa, everyone will be back soon. Me too. Come back whenever you're tired. Let me fix you up. Yes, thank you, sir. God, that's heavy stuff, man. Take care. So can I not do anything with seed quite yet? Uh, oh, maybe I can. Thought, like, the seed's power was lost for the moment or something. But we know we received the seed's power, so there you go. God. Uh, so we got another village that needs saving here, I guess. Okay. Let's see. This is a cool looking village though. Reminds me of like something, this is like just, I don't know, something, it's, it kind of reminds me of Saturn Valley to be honest with you. Yeah, can I like go in these? Uh, I guess not, they're too little for me to fit in. Edge could probably fit in there though. It's home village. Hmm. Well, now that that's all sorted out, uh, I guess we should go ahead and see about that crystal finally. See what we can do with that, now that we have, a uh, whatever its name was, <laughs> it's a freaking wind elemental, it was like so confusing, it was like Sylpha f f do or something. Mm. God, there's like a million silk tails around here, they're like all in the same spot exactly. Hey, Sydney reached level 18, and this is the wrong way. Mm, yes, 18, my favorite number. Good edge, <laughs> crap. Yeah. Forget these guys for now, let's just head over here. I can't wait to see what this crystal does, I was so, like, 
so freaking excited about it before trying every single possible kind of magic on it. But uh, now we have a uh, let's see, un not undyne, sylphid. There we go. That's not too hard to remember. So we got air blast, silence, and thunderbolt. Who has the who has analyzer? Is that like a spell here? Yeah, it is. Okay. Let's see. <laughs> That's neat. Sylphid's magic will work. Okay. Well, there we go then. So let's, uh, Thunderbolt, Silence, or Air Blast. I guess just Air Blast. Let's see. Uh. Ooh, Boomerangs. Oh, nice. Which clears the way. I don't know how that works, but... Ah, crap. I'm glad it does work. You know, then I think about it. I should have gone back to the Moogle Village to get that Boomerang orb fused. Uh, and Argon reaches level 18. How convenient, because Argon's atomic number is 18. In case you didn't know. Let's see, Riot Gas? Crap. That's so weird to see something like that in this kind of game. Like, Riot Gas, you associate that with, like, New Age antics and stuff, but... I don't know. He <laughs> just explodes into feathers. Sweet. God, this place is so beautiful. I tell you what. This actually reminds me a bit of like in the f is the when I used to live in Canmore that we had like this big a big ass forest just a little bit beyond our backyard. And we would always go out there and like explore and there was one time we found like this awesome creek. And that's and that creek, that just that little area, that hidden oasis in the desert not in the desert, in the forest. This, this is what that's what that f this forest reminds me of. It's just so good. Mm, oh, even more so now that we got the water here. Good lord, how perfect of a metaphor can you get? Well, not really metaphor. I guess that would be more of just an analogy or comparison or something. Steamed crabs, spaced out. Steamed crabs, so he's already cooked and ready for eatins. Well, if that's the case, why don't we just eat him instead of slashing him to death? That's what I would do. Yeah, so what do you say he has said something about going to Matango? And I wonder if that's where that person that uh, Luca was talking about before is. Can you guys get up? <laughs> they were just like sitting there. like I guess they were trying to plank or something. But that's not exactly how you do it. You know, you're doing it wrong. Sorry to say. There's like a million more ways to go again now. More per permutations of the path. God, these crawler things are so weird to hit. I guess, like, you have to be at 100% to hit them, and I just wasn't. And that's why it wasn't working. Maybe it's one of those enemies. Who knows, though. And we've got these nemesis owls. Was that exactly 100 damage? That's so funny. It probably wasn't. It was probably just a trick of my eyes. It was probably like 106 or 108 or something. Dude. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Ar Argon's down to freaking 17 health. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, no, not that. We want this. Not, no. You do, I suck at navigating these menus, I tell you what. Uh, yeah, we'll just cast on everyone. Everyone could use a little bit of a healing up. Bit of a refresher. Mm, sleep flower, too. You got, you suck, you guys. God. All right. And you know something I just noticed before this recording session, too? Is that, uh, down on the icons, like, next to our health and stuff, like, there's a little one next to my head. And I think that indicates, like, which player you're controlling right now. I thought that was, like, all confusing, because, like, you could press the button and not know, like, which character you're controlling, since they're all moving all at the same time. But I guess that's how you dictate that, so... I didn't even realize that I was like that. Freaking crab. Steam crab. They look so glazed. I mean, look at their eyes. They're just like... These are these are things you'd see in Little Nemo, not in this game. <laughs> Did I attack him like mid-thunder saber? That was so funny. I like totally stopped him and he was just like... And his mouth was all doing the zigzag. And Edge reached level 18 there. I saw that too. We're gaining levels like gangbusters. Apparently these guys drop a lot of experience. God, I'm coughing up a storm today. I tell you what, I guess that's better than yawning up a storm, but... 
Well, to be honest, I don't know about that, because, like, sure, coughs are more short, and they're not, and they're, like, not as intrusive, I guess, but they're just more loud, and, like, like, what's wrong with you if you're coughing like that? You're crazy. Mm, oh, we got a little cave. It's a little bit of a cabin here. Well, if I know my video games, caverns are always the place to be. What in the world are you? You look like that one boss from Battle Kid. At least your armor does. We got more of these freaking Rolladillo guys too. Uh, you know I'm gonna cast. I'm gonna cast magic on you. Yeah, how you like this? Uh, not that one. I want edge of magic here. He looks like something that would be weak to this thunderbolt thing I saw before, so I'm gonna try that. Kimono bird. That ain't no kimono, dude. Well, I guess it is kind of. Ah, eh, that did reasonably well. Pebbler, yeah. That's what those guys are called. I don't know, this reminds me so much of, like, Rolladillo. Shit, I died! Wow! That sucks. Alright, do I have any Cups of Wishes, at least? I should. Yeah, there we go. Like, come on. That's just retarded what happened there. Uh, Edge, try... <coughs> Hmm, let's try, uh, gnome, I guess. Let's try gem missile. I don't know. Flying enemies seem to be weak to that gnome crap. Oh my god, yeah, wow. Um, that was pretty good. Okay, right, switch back to Argon. We gotta be controlling him. <laughs> well, this is a stalemate, if I ever saw one. There we go. He got whacked from behind the slag slagma. I was about to say stalactite. A lot of people seem to confuse stalagmite and stalactite and for good reason. And I'm pretty sure I've talked about this like in a video before, or at least in like comments. Damn, I can't actually go this way? Well that sucks. There's not like another skull switch I can hit around here, is there? God. We don't have a re wanna have a repeat of that episode. Mm. Anyways, like I was saying, I think I brought this up in a video before, but uh the way I like to differentiate and remember which is which between stalagmite and stalactite is that stalagmite has a G in it, and they come up from the ground, whereas stalactite has a C in it, and it comes down from the ceiling. It's just a little thing that I picked up like a long time ago, and just never forgot it, you know? Those little mnemonic, mnemonic devices. Is that how you say that, mnemonic? It just sounds so weird. Oh well. Do you, guys, do you guys have any little mnemonic devices like that, though? God, I, I still, that just doesn't sound right. Like, apparently the M in that word isn't, isn't silent, but it seems like it, it should, because, like, how often do you see an N, like an M followed by an N, and it's not, and one of them isn't silent or something? I don't know. That's just the way it tends to work. Alright, so I can't go in that cave that was up there, so there must be... Some other path that I'm not seeing here. Of course, there always is. So, he just cast Thunder Saber on that Silk Tail. That's funny. You guys, you're crazy. These things have like a lot of HP too. I've noticed. Good lord. All right, uh, I think we might need to do a bit of healing on Sydney and Edge. You can also heal yourself if you want. I guess. He didn't really need it as much, but uh. Whatever. Or have we gone down this way yet? This looks a little, little, little bit of a wraparound. We're not gonna find like a Celebi shrine here, are we? All right, dude. These things like take forever to die. Okay, there we go. Sydney reached level 19. Good lord! I'm telling you, I'm telling you, this is just so crazy with these level ups. I'm not even gonna bother with those crawlers anymore. They're just not worth my time. I tell you. I mean, not only are they, like, the ugliest things, and I can't even tell where their eyes are. So, like, oh shit, Edge is, like, almost dead. <laughs> We're kind of all almost dead. I guess not dealing with those crawlers wasn't exactly the way to go, was it? Come on, heal us. God. <laughs> Sydney fell unconscious, that's why. But. Alright, there we go. And Argon level up, it sounded like. Yup, there we go. Reached level... Uh, 19. Alright, yeah, just cast this on everyone. I know Argon's at full health after that level up, but I just don't feel like casting it individually on everyone that needs it. Alright. 
I maybe should be switching weapons around here just to see what works best. See what has what side effects and stuff. Hello, Nemesis Owl. I haven't seen one of you in a long time. Oh, and now you're dead. Hope you enjoy your stay at Hotel Dargon. Hotel Excelsior. Okay. Something down here, maybe? No, it doesn't look like it, because there's rocks blocking my path. There's a rock in my foot! You get it. Off my case. You're so weird. These things deal out pretty heavy damage, too, I've noticed, the crawlers. I guess it makes sense with all those, like, spiny spikes and stuff, and their raspy tongues that they seem to have. Don't do that. Come on. I can't even see the enemy. This is ridiculous. Alright, Argon, you need to wake up. I know it's Sleep Flower too, and it's a nice, beautiful day. Perfect for sleeping under a tree like you were doing. It's actually, like, a day like that today, too. I mean, it's, like, 9 o'clock now, but it's still, like, really bright outside because it's pretty much summer now. <laughs> today being, uh, May 31st. Probably won't see this, or probably won't get uploaded until June 1st, but... Oh, you never know. I could upload late if I wanted to. If I really wanted to. You got what you got the guts. You got what it takes, kid. I love I know it's like so stupid, like I shouldn't love how the how the characters fall asleep like that just randomly when well not randomly, when they get cast upon. But like it's just so ridiculous. Wait, where am Dude, I just came back through here. Well you know what, that's okay, because I want to go back to the Moogle village to get this boomerang orb infused anyways. I am trapped up here. Thank you. I was trapped by a silk tail and I had no way to escape. He healed one. <laughs> Good lord. Alright, yeah, I'm probably gonna need to heal as... Well, I'm, I guess I can go see uh, Edge's grandpa to heal in a little bit, but first I want to head back to the Moogle Village to get however many orbs I have infused. Apparently I have orbs too that I haven't infused yet, even though I like, had them when I had the chance to infuse them. I don't know what that was. I guess, like, just the dark coloring of the weapon led me to believe that I didn't, or something? I don't know. All I know is that's what one of the comments said. God, I've got over 10,000 gold. Look at that. Alright, let's see. What can I infuse here? Uh, it looks like only the boomerang or the chakram. And that turns it into the load boomerang. Man, load. Such a heavy load. Moogle claws. Yeah, I forgot about those. Yeah, I guess that's it for now. Oh, uh, let's see here. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and go to Edge's, uh, grandpa and heal. So, uh, I'm gonna go do that and probably meet you back in the springtime area or something. I don't know where I'm gonna meet you. This place is such a maze, it's hard to meet you anywhere. But, I'll find a way.